ang karunungan ay kapangyarihan. And it's time once again to put that power to the test here on K-Check! Hello everyone, I am Guns Gia. Ako naman po si Gabby Concepcion, the attorney, not the artista, and this is K-Check. The search continues for those na gustong sanayin at palawakin ang brain power nila through competition. Let's find out together kung kaya nila ang brain workout natin for this season. Samahan nyo kami until the final week of competition when we reveal our next K-Check champion. Apat na nursing students mula sa Our Lady of Fatima University ang dadaan sa ating karunungan check sa araw na ito. Firstly, we have Heart. Heart loves competing in choral groups. In her spare time, she reads, sings, and watches medical dramas. Next, we have Hadassah. Hadassah plays badminton. She likes to read and watch series and is a fan of K-pop groups. Next, we have Trish. Trish enjoys listening to music, watching movies and series, and stalking her Hollywood crushes. And finally, we have G. G likes the K and J. K-pop, K-dramas, K-movies, J-movies, and sometimes Western movies. And these four will be competing under the watchful eyes of today's K-Check panel of experts. First, we have Professor Marian Roque, Professor of Mathematics at UP Diliman. We also have Assistant Professor Bernard Caslib from the Department of Social Sciences, College of Arts and Sciences, UP Manila. And finally, Multimedia Artist and Professor Emeritus, who teaches film at the UP College of Mass Communication Film Institute, and communication at the UP Open University, we have Professor Grace Javier Alfonso. At ngayon, contestants, hawak na ni Jules ang mga tanong na kailangan ninyong sagutin. Get ready to buzz in, but wait to be called before answering. Please remember, only answer when you are recognized and acknowledged by the host. Otherwise, your answers might not be given any credit. Each correct answer is worth 10 points. Let's, Let's begin! begin. Question number one. Rishi Sunak became the Prime Minister of the UK in October 2022. What does UK stand for? Trish. United Kingdom. United Kingdom is correct. Okay, check. Question number two. What do you call a public sale where the goods are sold to their highest bidder? Hadassah. Auction. Auction is correct. Okay, check. Question number three. What term may mean an instrument for weighing or a very small plate-like covering of a fish? The correct answer is scale. That is okay. Question number four. What is one of the smallest dog breeds whose name is taken from a place in Mexico where it was once plentiful. The correct answer is Chihuahua. Question number five. Which popular liquor of Russian origin is made by distillation of rye, wheat, or potatoes? Adasa. Beer. Beer is wrong. Anyone can steal. Three. Tequila. Tequila is wrong. Anyone can steal heart or G. Sayang G. The correct answer is vodka. Question number six. What do you call the negatively charged fundamental particle in ordinary atoms surrounding the nucleus? An ion. An ion. An ion is wrong. G. An ion. At ion is wrong. Alright. Electrons. Electrons or electron is correct. Okay, check. Question number seven. What is the name of the young wizard that actor Daniel Radcliffe first portrayed in the movies in 2001? G. Harry Potter. Harry Potter is correct. Okay, check. Question number eight. Which Binibining Pilipinas Universe 2009 winner co-starred with Rob Gomez in the television series Magandang Dilag. G. Bianca Manalo. Bianca Manalo is correct. K-check. 
Question number 9. In January 2024, a commercial airliner in a Coast Guard plane collided in one of the runways of the Haneda Airport. In what country can you find Haneda Airport? G. Japan. Japan is correct. K check. Question number 10 in geometry. What is the area in square meters of a rectangle that is 4 meters wide and 25 meters long? Trish. 100. 100 is correct. K check. Question number 11. Lucena is the capital of which province? Chris. Quezon. Quezon is correct. K check. Last question for this round number 12. What do you call the common weather instrument that is used to measure air pressure? The correct answer is barometer. And that's it for round number one. And after that round, we have Trish and G, who are tied for first place, followed by Hadassah and Hart, who are tied for second place. Lahat sila nakakasagot. Yes, congratulations sa inyo. Okay, chikahin na natin yung mga contestants natin. So, ginagawa natin to para siyempre mawala yung kaba natin. Okay, unahin natin si Hart. Hart, mahilig ka bang manood ng medical dramas in preparation for your future as a nurse? At ano-ano tong mga medical dramas na nabanggit mo? Um, yung pinaka-favorite ko po is yung Grey's Anatomy. Ayun po. Classic. I was about to say yes. Grey's Anatomy. Sunod so, naman si Hadassah, very beautiful name. So, can you tell us more about that name? It came from the Bible. It is, I think it, it, fro, it was from the book of Esther. From Old Testament. Okay. And nabanggit din natin kanina na mahilig ka mag-badminton. Uh, yes. Ano yung mga ginagawa mong preparations para siyempre maging mahusay ka sa sport na to? Ano lang po siya, parang pastime ng churchmates namin. Para lang, in, imbis na kumakain lang kami, nag-exercise na lang po kami. Para balance eh. Oo, okay, mukha namang effective. Uh -oh. Effective kay Hadassah ang kanilang. Imbis na kumakain ay mag-badminton yes. na lang. Marami kang no inspire sense. sa ating lahat. But in any case, we always like getting to know our contestants. But in the meantime, itutuloy po natin ang usapan natin para mamaya. Pero right now, maganda tayong lahat for round two. Susunod na sa pagbabalik ng K-Check. At tuloy pa rin ang ating karunungan check. After that round, we have Trish and G tied for first place with 30 points each, Hadassah and Hart with 10 points each for second place. So tuloy ang ating pakipanayam sa ating mga contestants. Trish, paano mo sinastok ang Hollywood crushes mo? Siguro naman ito ay online at hindi physical ang pag-stock. No? Opo, oh, online pop. <laughs> like every after a movie po or series, parang I, I like to search their names, yung real names, ganyan. So, ganun po. So, na-fascinate ka dun sa acting nila. Mm -hmm. Ngayon gusto mo sundan yung karera nila. Yes, yes po. Thank you so much, Trish. Ito naman si Jay. Si G pala, si G. Bakit ganun na lang yung fascination mo with the K's and J's of entertainment? So, yun yung K-pop, J-pop, K-dramas, etc. Kasi pag napapanood ko sila, feeling ko nakakalilit ako sa, kunyari, sa kanta, ganyan. Tapos, yung sa K-movies or K-dramas, ang gaganda po kasi ng mga plots nila yung pag-execute ng acting, ganyan. Totoo naman talaga yun. Oo. Pero talagang, Every day, every day when we talk to our contestants, invariably, meron talagang K-pop, K-drama fan talaga. Kaya it's nandito really... rin sila sa K-check. Okay, that was a nice <laughs> okay. one, Jules. <laughs> okay, tuloy-tuloy po In tayo. In fairness, <laughs> nakakatawa siya. Okay, maraming salamat contestants for sharing your stories with us. But now, it's time to get back to the competition. This is round two. Remember to wait to be acknowledged before answering, where each correct answer is worth 20 points. However, you lose 10 points if you answer incorrectly. Let's begin! This is round two. First question. Which bitter alkaloid compound in coffee and tea is a potent stimulant of the central nervous system? Adasa. Caffeine. Caffeine is the correct answer. K-check. Question number two. The Acropolis is a hill in Athens that comprises one of the greatest architectural and artistic complexes in history. 
In what country can you find the Acropolis? Trish. Greece. Greece is the correct answer. K check. Question number three, this time in general science. What do you call the property of an object to restore its shape after deformation? Hadassah. Liquid. The answer is incorrect. The property of an object to restore its shape is called elasticity. Question number four in math this time. What is defined to be the percentage or amount obtained when you subtract the sale price from the regular selling price? G. Discount. Discount is the correct answer. K check. Question number five. Neurology is a branch of medicine that is concerned with the function and diseases of what system of the body? Trish. Brain. The answer is incorrect. G. Neurology. Well, neurology is the branch, but we need to know what system of the body? Heart. Nervous system. Nervous system is the correct answer. K check. Question number six in science again. What metal is the most common element on Earth by mass just ahead of oxygen? G. Aluminum. The answer is incorrect. Heart. Iron. Iron is the correct answer. K check. Question number seven. What term that comes from placeholder in French is a military rank just below a captain? Adasa. Sergeant. The answer is incorrect. Heart. Lieutenant. Lieutenant is the correct answer. K check. Question number eight. Protesters rallied in December 2023 in the capital of the European Union for better public services, salaries, and living conditions. In what city did the protest happen, which is also the capital of Belgium? G. Germany. The answer is incorrect. Art. Brussels. Brussels is the correct answer. Brussels is the capital of Belgium. Question number nine. What word may be the main body of a tree, a large piece of luggage, or the back part of a car? Hadassa. Trunk. Trunk is the correct answer. K check. Question number 10. What term is defined to be a period or place of isolation in which people or animals that may have been exposed to infectious disease are placed? Heart. Quarantine. Quarantine is the correct answer. K check. Question number 11. The song Closer Than This made it to number one at the United States World Music Charts in 2023. Which member of BTS recorded Closer Than This? G. The answer is incorrect. Adasa. V. The answer is incorrect. The correct answer is Jimin. And now for our last and final question for this round, question number 12. Named after a young donkey in Spanish, what Mexican dish is distinguished from a taco because it is usually a full meal wrapped in a larger tortilla? Adasa. Burrito. Burrito is the correct answer. And that's it for our second round. Points recap tayo. Hart is leading with 110 points. Followed by Hadasa and Trish na may 40 points each. At si G naman ay may 10 points. Up next, ang pinakahinihintay na ultimate pagalingan round. Dito lang yan sa... K-Check! Welcome back everyone. Points Rika muna tayo. Heart is leading with 110 points. Followed by Hadasa and Trish with 40 points each. At si G naman ay may 10 points. In the lead man, si Heart ngayon ay may chance pa rin ang iba na makahabol as we go into our ultimate pagalingan round. 
Remember, sa ating panel of experts manggagaling ang mga katanungan. And this is your last chance para humabol. Dito, correct answers are worth 30 points each at my 15-point deduction for wrong answers. Let's begin! Simulan na natin ang ultimate pagalingan round. First question will come from Prof. Marian. Alin sa sumusunod na klase ng cells ang walang nucleus? A. Muscle cell B. Nerve cell C. White blood cell D. Red blood cell and E or E. Brain cell C. Letter A. Letter A. Muscle cell. Mali. Naku, pag nursing kayo, dapat alam nyo ito. <laughs> most of our body cells have a nucleus, the central part of most cells. But some types of cells do not have a nucleus. At ito ay ang red blood cell. So the correct answer is D, red blood cell. Thank you. Next question, Prof. Bernard. From economics. According to the law of demand, what happens to the quantity demanded of a good when its price increases, assuming all other factors remain constant? A. Increases. B. Decreases. C. Remains constant. D. Becomes elastic. Or E. Becomes inelastic. Hard. Increases. A. Increases. That's correct. K. Check. Thank you. Prof. Gigi, next question. What is the very popular folk dance in the Philippines that is said to have originated from Mindoro? This dance of lights simulates fireflies at dusk and at night. It uses three oil lamps that the dancer has to balance, one on the head and one on the back of each hand. Sometimes you can also use candles in the glass, no, to do this. A, kuti kuti tap. B, pandango sa ilaw. C, maglalatik. And D, kuratsa. And E, Trish, pandango sa ilaw. The music to which it is danced was composed by Antonio Buenaventura, native of Bulacan but at the same time also teaching in UP, Conservatory of Music. This was in the 1930s. Yes, pandango sa ilaw, letter B, keche. Botany, biology. Alin sa mga sumusunod ang hindi bunga? A, ampalaya. B, palay. C, kamatis. D, sibuyas. Or E, Buko. Hadasa. D. Sibuyas. Botanically, a fruit is a mature ovary. Ito yung reproductive body of a seed plant. Coconut is not a nut. It's actually a fruit. Lahat ay may seeds na except sibuyas. It is the edible bulb of the onion plant. Correct answer is D. Sibuyas. K-check. This is from the history of philosophy. Which is the title of René Descartes' work where he famously claimed, I think, therefore I am? A. Discourse on method. B. Principles of philosophy. C. Passions of the soul. D. Meditations on first philosophy. Or E. The world. Fish. The world. Sorry, the world is, well, not the word. Hindi umabot. Okay, so the correct answer is letter D, no? Meditations on first philosophy. What René Descartes did here, no, was he tried to doubt everything until he realized that, oops, wait, I'm thinking, so there must be something certain I can conclude that I'm thinking and therefore, I must exist. So, doon nagmula yung, I think, therefore, I am. Uh, for decades, many have called the festival as the undisputed mother of all Philippine festivals that has served as inspiration for many festivals, big and small, all across our archipelago. So, your choices are Dinagyang Festival, 
Gigantes Festival, Payas Festival, Atiatihan Festival, Aliwan Festival. Heart. Payas Festival. No. G. Letter D. Atiatihan Festival happens in the month of January in Aklan in Panay Island. Yes. Okay, check ka na. Ito, as nursing students, you study chemistry also. Ayun, ba't ang sama na mukha nyo? Okay. <laughs> Which of the following is a non-metal? A. Aluminum B. Potassium C. Beryllium D. Sodium or E. Sulfur G. Letter B. Mali. Heart. Beryllium. Mali din. Hadasa. Full of four. Believe it or not, potassium and sodium and beryllium are all metals. Among those given, ang non-metal ay ang sulfur. Letter E. Okay, check. This question is from geography. The province of Sikihor is known for its mystic charm and natural attractions. In which region can Sikihor be found? A. Central Visayas B. Eastern Visayas C. Western Visayas D. Northern Mindanao Or letter E. Davao Region Letter A, no Central Visayas. Ito naman tayo sa teatro. PETA undertakings are from professional theater repertory performances, year-round workshops, and its community and outreach programs. What does the acronym PETA stand for? A, Philippine Experimental Theater Association. Philippine Educational Theater Association, that's B. C. People's Experimental Theater Academy. D. Public Education Theater Academy. And E. Philippine Extension Theater Association. C. Letter B. Yes, letter B. Philippine Educational Theater Association and this association uses the power of theater for development and empowerment for the most disadvantaged sectors of our society. Kay Check! Thank you. Now we're at this point, magkalapit yes. na si Hart at saka si Hadasa. Only by 10 points. Only by 10 points. So now we're off to our last set of questions exactly. for this round. Prof. Marian, go ahead. Ang tanong, which of the following does not give a temperature scale or unit of temperature? A. Celsius B. Fahrenheit C. Kelvin D. Rankin or E. Pascal Hadasa D. Rankin Mali Hard Pascal Rankin kasi medyo weird but it's actually a unit of temperature hindi siya usual Pascal is the standard unit for pressure so the correct answer is E. Pascal mm -hmm. K-check uh, Sana alam rin nila to Medyo related naman sa nursing This is from uh, Demography Okay What term refers to the number Of live births Per 1,000 Population in a given year A. Mortality rate B. Birth rate C. Migration rate D. Growth rate or E, aging rate? Trish. B, birth rate. Birth rate is K check. Last question for this round, Prof. Okay, last question. What is the cultural religious celebration in Tacloban based on the body painting traditions of the ancient tattooed warriors and also put together? A celebration for the Señor Santo Niño. Letter A, Mascara Festival. B, Panagbenga Festival. C, Sinulog Festival. D, Pintados Kasadyaan Festival. 
y Moriones Festival. This festival is held annually in the month of June and yes, letter D, Pintados Kasadian Festival. K-Check. And that's it for K-Check Ultimate Pagalingan. Congratulations to Hart, our K-Check Daily winner. With a final score of 140 points, we'll see her again tomorrow when she competes with our other daily winners for a spot in our semi-finals. Congratulations once again. And of course, maraming salamat kay Hadasa, Trish, and G for joining. And to the members of our panel of experts, Professor Marianne, Professor Bernard, and Professor Gigi. This has been Attorney Gabby Concepcion. And I'm Jules Giang. Please join us again tomorrow for another K-Check. K -check.